This next story is just funny to me. This is um, Trump was doing a press conference and he made an offhand remark to a reporter uh, that I thought was was pretty noteworthy. Mr. President, two questions about uh, a couple of things you've tweeted about in the last few days. Uh, were you meaning to criticize Vice President Biden for wearing a mask yesterday? And can you explain why you've been tweeting about a conspiracy theory that has been proven to not be true? No, Biden can wear a mask, but he was standing uh, outside with his wife, perfect conditions, perfect weather. They're inside, they don't wear masks. And so I thought it was very unusual that he had one on. But I thought that was fine. I wasn't criticizing him at all. Why would I ever do a thing like that? And uh, your second question was, I couldn't hear you. The can, second you can you take it off? Because I cannot hear I'll, you. I'll just speak louder, sir. Oh, this, okay, good. You want to be politically correct. Go ahead. No, sir. I just want to wear go the mask. Ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, Come on, man. It's like, he's like... <laughs> he's like a parody of an anti-science right-wing person. That's what he is. He said... Oh, you want to keep the mask on? You want to be politically correct? Uh, is that what you want to do? You want to be politically correct? Now, it seemed like he was half joking. So I don't like it, this his story isn't that serious. He's obviously fine with the guy keeping the mask on. But it's just funny to me that we're, we're now in a place in time where there are people out there who genuinely think if you want to wear a mask during a pandemic, that you're politically correct. <laughs> My interpretation of somebody wearing a mask during a pandemic is that they want to be safe, they want to be careful, they don't want to die. <laughs> and by the way, there are plenty of people out there who are immunocompromised. And as we know from all the data and all the evidence, people who are immunocompromised and have certain pre-existing conditions, respiratory problems, for example, if they get coronavirus, they get hit hard, son. So, like, if you're older, the numbers show you're at greater risk of coronavirus killing you. If you're immunocompromised or you have, like, respiratory problems or any of a number of problems, that is worse off. You're worse off and you could die. So, Trump has no idea if that guy could have, you know, some sort of pre-existing condition. That guy could be immunocompromised. I mean, he really called it politically correct? <laughs> It's politically correct to wear a mask. Me, bro? I don't wear a mask in a... I'm a, I'm a macho man. I don't wear a mask in a pandemic. All right? <laughs> That's not macho. That's not like... They're freaking... It's a virus, and it's tiny, and it's invisible to the naked eye. To not wear a mask, there's nothing, like, strong about that or masculine about that. Like... And for Trump, of all people, like, you're always around other people. You're the president. And so whenever you're with somebody, you are with not just them, but everyone that they've been with in the past couple days or, or since the last time they took a shower, let's say, in the last day. So, like, do you really, everybody around you and everybody they've been around in the day, that's a lot of people. If just one of them gets it, then you can get it. It is kind of amazing that he hasn't gotten it to this point, isn't it? Because he was hanging out at Mar-a-Lago and there was like Bolsonaro was there and Bolsonaro's like right hand man in his cabinet had Corona and then there was speculation that Bolsonaro had it and they were all they were sit eating dinner at the same table with Trump and they were right next to each other taking pictures. Homeboy was right behind him in one of the pictures and sort of a miracle that he hasn't had it or maybe he has had it and he has got the immunity and he's just one of the people who's genetically kind of lucky and predisposed to being asymptomatic. I don't know. We still don't know all that much about this virus. But what I do know is um, wearing a mask is not politically correct. One could argue it's just correct. <laughs>